Legal Documents is an extension for the WP Travel Engine plugin that allows you to upload and display legal documents relevant to your travel business on your website. The documents uploaded through this add-on can help establish the credibility of your business and the services you offer. Hello and welcome back to WP Travel Engine YouTube channel. In this video, I will show you how to install and configure Legal Documents add-on step by step. Let's get started. Please note, Legal Documents require WP Travel Engine version 5 plus installed and activated on your site. First, I will show you how you can install and activate the Legal Documents add-on. From your WordPress admin dashboard, navigate to Plugins and click on Add New. Click on Upload Plugin. Click on Choose File. Select the zip file and click on Open. Now you have to click on Install Now. The plugin has now been installed successfully. Now you have to click on Activate Plugin to activate it. The Legal Documents add-on has now been installed and activated. Next, you will have to activate the plugin license. For that, navigate to WP Travel Engine and click on Plugin License. Here, you will have to copy and paste the license key that you received during the purchase of the add-on. Your license key looks something like this. Then, you have to click on Save Changes button. Now, click on Activate License button. The license key for Legal Documents add-on is now activated on this side. The main idea behind activating the license key is to receive regular updates from our team. Now, I will show you how to add the documents. From under WP Travel Engine, navigate to Legal Documents and you have to click on it. On your right hand side, under Upload Documents, you have to add in the document name as well as the description for the document. So let's add in the document name first. Then let's add the description. Now click on the Choose File button and you'll have to select the document. The documents you add can be in JPEG, PNG and PDF format. After selecting the document, click on Open. Now you have to click on the Upload Now button. The document that you have added is now displaying here. Following the same process, you can upload other documents. Following the same process, I have added more documents. Now to display the added documents on a page, Go to Pages and click on Add New. I will open the link in the new tab. Now add the title. Let's add the title as Legal Documents. Now you have to click on the Add Block icon. From the search bar, type short code. And here is the short code block. You have to click on it to enter it. Here, you have to copy and paste the following shortcode. Please note, the shortcode has argument option calls to provide the number of columns while displaying documents. So here, instead of 3, I will set 2 to display 2 columns while displaying the documents. You can select the number of columns as per your requirement. Now before I click on publish, I will select the sidebar layout as full width and let's click on publish button the legal documents page has been published now let's view the page in the new tab in the front end and here is your legal documents page your site visitors will be able to view through the documents by clicking on them respectively 
they will also be able to see the document name as well as the description that you added earlier from the dashboard for each of the documents. Now I will also walk you through the features of the add-on. For that, let's head back to our dashboard. As a site administrator, you can preview, edit, delete, and sort the order of the added documents. To edit the document, you simply have to click here on the edit document icon and you will be able to edit the name as well as the description of the document. After making the changes, you have to click on the update now button. This way, you won't have to delete and re-upload the files with any incorrect information. To preview the document, you simply have to click on the eye icon. You can get a quick preview of the image or PDF file you have uploaded for each document by simply clicking on the eye icon. To delete the document, it is very simple. You can simply click on the delete icon that is available for each of the documents that you have added. The options to edit and preview the document is also available for all of the legal documents that you have added. Lastly, you can also sort the document as per your preference. To demonstrate an example, if I wish to display the second document right at the very end, I'll have to hover my cursor over it first, then you have to sort of grab it, and you'll have to drag and drop it. You can do the same with the rest of the documents as well. To view the changes in the front end, let's go to our side in the front end and let's give it a refresh. And you will see the order of the documents has changed. So that was it. If you have any questions or confusions, please do let me know in the comment section below or you can directly reach out to our support team with the help of the link I have added in the description box below. If you are liking our videos so far, please give us a like, share this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you in our next video.